Today we are going to be doing three digit by two digit subtraction with regrouping. We are doing 145 minus 28. I'm going to draw the lines to separate and don't get confused with your hundreds, tens, and ones. So this is going to, the one is going to be in your hundreds place. Your four and your two is in your tens place. And your five and your eight is going to be in your ones place. So we're going to subtract five from eight. But we're going to go back and remember what we said. If there's more on the floor, go next door and get ten more. Okay? So we're going to go ahead and put a manipulus. We got one hundred and we're going to put four tens. One, two, three, four, and we have five ones. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. Now, since we're going, so this since there's more on the floor, we go next door and get ten more. So we're gonna borrow from the four. So we're going to take one, so this becomes a three, and we're going to give that one that we borrowed to the ones, which is going to be 15 now. So we're going to go ahead and put 10 more. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and Now that we have that, we're going to subtract 8 from 15. So we're going to take away 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now we're going to count how many we have left. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Now we have 3 minus 2. We're going to take away 2 from the tens place. Now we're going to have 1. We have nothing here. We can say 0. So 1 minus 0 or nothing is 1. So your answer, so your difference is going to be 117. The other way that we have done it before in the other videos is we're using our helping hands. So we know that then if there's more on the floor, we go next door and get 10 more. So we're going to follow the same method. We're going to borrow next door. And this 4 becomes a 3. And this 5, since we borrow, will become a 15. So we're going to start. Are we going to keep that number 8 in our head? Or are we going to use it? And we're going to say 8. And we're just going to make sure we stop at 15. So we say 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So then we're going to count how many fingers we have now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then we have 3. 
and we're going to take away 2. 1, 2. So now we're going to have 1. Then 1 minus nothing or 1 minus 0 is going to be 1. So the difference is the same as the other one is 117. We are doing now 326 minus 59. I'm going to go ahead and remember, if more on the floor, go next door and get 10 more. So we're going to borrow from the 2, so we're going to take 1 out, we're going to borrow and we're going to add 10 more here. So we're going to add 1, 2, Put that one back. This is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And 10. So, so this borrow this 6 becomes 16. So now we have 16 minus 9. So we're going to take away 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we're going to have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 left. And since we borrow from 2, this stay as 1. So we can so we cannot subtract from 5 because there's more on the floor. So we're gonna go next door and get 10 more. So we're gonna borrow from the 3. This is going to become a2, and this is going to be 11. So we're going to borrow from the hundreds place, and we're going to take one of these, and we're going to add 10. So we have 1, 2, 3. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So now we have eleven tenths and we have minus five. So we're going to take away five. One, two, three, four, five. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six. And then two minus nothing or zero is gonna be two. So your answer is gonna be your difference is going to be 267. Now we're going to solve the same problem but on this time we're just going to be using our helping hands. So here we're going to do 326 minus 59. We're going to do 6 minus 9. We cannot subtract that because there's more on the floor so we got to go next door and get 10 more. So we're going to borrow from the 2. 2 becomes a 1. That 6 becomes a 16. So we're going to keep 9 in our head and we're going to tap here and say 9 and that's where we're going to start and we're going to stop at 16. So we say 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Now we're going to count how many fingers we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There's more on the floor so we're going to go next door and borrow. From that 3, and that 3 becomes a 2, and that becomes a 11. 
So now we're going to do 11 minus 5. So we're going to start with 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And we're going to go ahead and count in fingers. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then we have 2 minus nothing or 0 is going to be 2. So our difference is going to be 267. Okay, now we're going to be doing 204 minus 78. Okay. And we subtract 4 from 8, but we can't because there's more on the floor. So we're going to go next door and get 10 more. But we can't get nothing from 0 because it's already 0. So we're going to go ahead and instead of borrowing from 0, we're going to borrow from 20 to give 1 to 4. So instead of that, we're going to borrow and this becomes 19 because we borrow from 20 we borrow 1 so this is going to become now 14 then we're going to say start with 8 we're going to go 8 and we're going to stop at 14 so we say 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 so then we're going to count how many fingers we have we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 Now we're going to do 9 minus 7. So if there's more on top, there's no need to stop. And we're going to subtract. 9 minus 7 is going to be 2. And now we have 1 minus 0 or nothing is going to be 1. Now we're doing 502 minus 17. So we're subtracting 2 minus 7. We can't because there's more on the floor. So we're going to go next door and get 10 more. But we can't get no more from 0 because it's already 0. So we're going to go ahead and borrow from 50. So when we borrow from 50 and we're going to borrow 1. So that 50 becomes 49 and that becomes 12. So we're going to go ahead and keep 7 in our head. Or we're going to say 7 and then we're going to 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we're going to count how many fingers we have. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We're going to go ahead now and see if there's more on top. There's no need to stop. So we're going to subtract 9 minus 1. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9. And we're going to subtract 1. So now we're going to see how many fingers we got left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now we do 4 minus nothing or 0 is going to be 4. So the difference is going to be 485. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe.